Jeff Slauson here from 19 News Now at the 19 News Digital Desk. We have some new video here into the newsroom that shows what North Olmsted police are looking at as a theft of a wireless store in North Olmsted. This happened early this morning. It was a pretty quick in and out, pretty quick uh, grab there. But there's a couple of different ways I want to look at this and a couple of different ways I want to show you the video itself. We're going to watch just the straight up security camera footage that you would normally see. This has four boxes in there and I want you to keep an eye out for the top left and top right ones. And then we're going to kind of talk our way through this here. But let's start with just the main video. I'll have you watch this through as you see the three thieves break into this wireless store and start to steal what is behind the counter. I'll stop talking right now so you can get an honest look at this a couple of times and then we'll talk our way through it. Right, now watch it one more time as they break into uh, that door there. All right, so let's start our way through this uh, right now. First, this only took about 30 minutes or so from the door actually being smashed into, and you can see in one of the views a brick at the end being thrown through. So uh, only about 30 seconds once the brick breaks down the door from when they enter that wireless shop to when they leave. In addition to that, this is at about 1 a.m., Keep an eye out for the way that they're getting through the door. We've all walked through doors where you have the bar, I'm, I'm about six feet tall, but that bar that's kind of in the middle of your chest area. They seem to walk under it with very little bending involved, uh, so that can help to at least determine who these potentially are when looking at the size of these people. Another thing I want you to watch out for, you see one of the suspects walk behind the counter, grab something, and then look to put it inside of their backpack. Unsure what that is. We were trying to figure out exactly what that was, but he packs that into the, or they pack that into the backpack and then they ultimately uh, do leave there. Two of the suspects at the same time are smashing a display case, take some cell phones, and that's when they leave. Uh, the suspects were, let's see, it was about 1 a.m. Yeah, so this is the Olmstead Wireless uh, on Brook Park and they stole dozens of electronics in the process. So now let's show you here, this breaks down the different views of it, okay? So you saw them walk through there, barely going under the, underneath that door, and this gives you a clear picture of how they did this. All right, I'm going to switch camera angles to the next one. Watch the front of this. You'll see the brick kind of roll through. There. See that brick on the, on the ground on top of that AT&T sign? So that's what they used to get in. Tons of merchandise to the right, to the left. They seem to center all of that right on the case. All right, and then lastly, we'll show you one more angle here once the last two suspects leave. And then here you go. Here's the last uh, view. So, yeah, the height showing of these, these three people here uh, potentially could show that they are younger. And then stealing 
the phones and the electronics from the store. So again, police are asking for help in locating these people. The number is 440-777-3535. Let me just put that on the screen right now. So that number is now on our screen. If you know any information, uh, police are asking that you call that number again, 440-777-3535. This is still a very active investigation. Show you one more time the video here and then the video with, uh, with it all together there. But watch again the way that they come in, kind of duck under that door with no problem. And then immediately, it seems, make their way behind the desk, make their way to the glass cases. It seems like they all had jobs defined, knew what they were doing. And that person there, that suspect there, goes for that specific case, grabs it, tries to fit some parts of it in their bag. Unsure what was in that, it looks like some sort of a display case. And then they just say, you know, we're gonna take the whole thing with us because there's too much stuff in here. They try to fit that in, they fit it in, but are not able to close the backpack and they just run out. So police are asking for help in this, are asking for any assistance that you may have. You can see that brick again against the ground. That is what they used, it seems, to get through the door and then ultimately break in. And there is that third angle. And then lastly, we'll show it to you all together one more time. Multiple angles here. You can see different uh, the different angles there showing the coordination involved in this. Again, this was the wireless shop in North Olmstead. This was just off of the Brook Park Road exit. It took about 30 seconds for them at about one o'clock this morning to go in, steal a bunch of electronics, and then leave. Pretty quick in and out operation, but see how easily they duck underneath that door? So watch as the last two leave. Look how, e like, yeah, I mean, you know, the average person would have to duck far more uh, when getting through that. All right, if you have any information, please uh, offer that to police. You can see the number on your screen right there, 440-777-3535. That's where the latest information can go. For now, I'm Jeff Slauson with 19 News. Our news is continuing over on 19 News. That started at 3 o'clock, so we hope to see you there. And, of course, we will have the news going until 6.30. We are, as well, live uh, from Tower City as the Cavs go to face off against the New York Knicks tonight for Game 5. Have a great day, everybody. Much more to come on air and online. 19 News.